he escaped the genocide in Rwanda. There are tens of thousands of people um, living in tents. Uh, there's no food, people are starving, and there's no clean water, and kids are dying because of, you know, diarrhea or all these diseases. And uh, there's not enough food, there's no hospitals, and uh, every time you just see people dying because of starvation and disease. He made a deal with God. I remember praying to God, I was like, God, if you see me through with school, I'm going to spend the rest of my life serving you, serving the orphans, serving the widows, and, and the less fortune. He has a reason to live. Towards the end of my um, undergraduate, uh, I was thinking about something big. 65% of the people in Rwanda live under below a dollar a day. So if my learning is coming in, this is a big tool that's going to help the people. So I was like, oh my goodness, if I can do this, if I can get involved, if I, we can help more people, then this is where God wants me to be.